Imagine thousands of satellites orbiting Earth, all trying to talk to the ground at the same time. Starlink, Kuiper, and future mega constellations could soon have tens of thousands of satellites. But here's the problem. Our ground stations can't keep up. In traditional mega constellations, every satellite must communicate with Earth-based control centers. And as the constellation grows, the system gets overloaded. Too many satellites, too many signals, bottlenecks, and finally, latency spikes. For networks like Starlink, high latency is a death sentence. The whole point is speed. Now scientists have a solution. Let these satellites manage themselves. A new study proposes a system where satellites use software-defined networking, or SDN. Instead of Earth controlling everything, the satellites choose leaders among themselves called center nodes. These manager satellites talk to Earth, while the rest, the member nodes, talk to their manager. It's like giving the constellation a brain in orbit. Each satellite calculates which manager to connect to using a clever new prediction algorithm. It estimates how long until two satellites drift too far apart, something called detachment time. The math is simple enough for a satellite computer, yet smart enough to avoid constant switching between managers. The result? A stable, self-organizing orbital network. In simulations with 1,248 satellites, the new system cut latency from 18.4 milliseconds to as low as 4.7 milliseconds. That's more than 50%. Faster without launching a single new satellite. This hasn't been deployed yet. But if Starlink or Kuiper adopt it, future mega constellations could become smarter, faster, and almost fully autonomous. The era of self-managing space networks is just beginning.